in that today? I think it was a team effort. You know, I, I, I made it a point to, you know, make sure I hit him, was physical with him. And, you know, I didn't really care if I got the rebound or not. You know, someone else was going to fly in and grab it. And, um, you know, I think the results spoke for themselves. You know, I think we had a great game plan coming into the game, and we were able to execute. What do you have to focus on differently when you're playing a team that goes small so often like that Clippers team does? Um, I mean, I think the biggest thing is just not changing the pace of the way you play. You know, switching it is designed to make you kind of second guess what you're doing or slow up the offense. But um, I think we did a good job of playing our game tonight. And, um, you know, it was a, it made it a lot easier for us to down the stretch just knowing what we needed to do. Rick and Tyrese have talked a lot about how the, the trust level in Tyrese to make the right plays in the fourth quarter for you as his teammate. How much trust do you have in him when he's out there to make a pass, make a score, do whatever the team needs in those? No, all the trust instances. in the world, man. Tyrese is, um, has proven time and time again that he can, um, you know, really take over in times like that. You know, towards the um, the end of the game, and he's doing a phenomenal job for us, and um, I, I believe he's going to uh, continue to do so. I just want to go back to what you said about just not caring if you got the rebound tonight and it being a team effort. I mean, what, what, like, is your mindset just hit Zubac first? I mean, like, what do you like? What was kind of your game plan, or your your mindset, of what do you had to get done? Yeah, exactly that. As long as he doesn't get the rebound, then you know I've done my job. And I think um, a couple times in the first quarter, you know, I, he, he got a couple loose ones, and you know that was on me. But um, as the game continued to go, I wanted to continue to make sure I just got him out the way and somebody else flew him for the rebound. And, um, you know, I think, uh, I think our guards did a phenomenal job of doing so. We talk about Halliburton finishing, but you as well. What were you sensing? What did you feel out there from your matchup and what you could do, especially there in the post? Um, well, exactly what he was saying. Um, you know, they went small. And, um, you know, in times like that, I got to assert myself a bit more. I think I did a good job of doing that. And, um, you know, my team put me in good positions. I was able to finish down the stretch, and I was able to get to the free throw line this game and uh, uh, make a lot of headway there as well. Do you want to say what you took personally? <laughs> I mean, we can really get into it if you want to, but I think you know the answer to that. You know, I think last game, you know, a lot of, there was a lot of noise being talked after that game, and um, you know, as a player, every now and then you look for you know certain motivations to get you get you going or whatnot. And tonight was one of those situations for me. So you know, it was a. Uh, um, I just I took the matchup personally, yeah. All right.